Hey guys, it's Tom from FitCure. Welcome back to another lesson, lesson three on carbohydrates. Today we are talking all about the hierarchy of carbohydrates. Okay, so we're going to initially just say starchy carbohydrates, the goal of the starchy carbohydrates. So yesterday, just to tap back into that, we spoke about maybe having those pastas, rices, potatoes, oats, those kind of things post-workout. The goal of a starchy carbohydrate is to provide energy, fiber, vitamins, and minerals. That is the goal, yeah? So when we're thinking about when we're going to put them, obviously we're looking post-workout. Workout. So there's three different types of carbohydrates, type one, two, and three, believe it or not, type one, two, and three, the hierarchy of carbohydrates. So right at the top of the pyramid, we've got high fiber carbohydrates. They're things like most vegetables, fruits, and beans and pulses, yeah? Type two, what we were talking about, the starchy carbohydrates, your sweet potatoes, your starchy fruits, things like bananas, plants and figs, uh, dates, whole grain rice, wild brown and white, and the oats themselves, yeah? These are the bad boys that we'd be looking at putting in post-workout within one to two hours. And lastly, the bad boys on the menu, the good stuff, the stuff that tastes phenomenal, that my body says is not good for my body composition, is the highly processed carbohydrates. Things like your pastries, cookies, sweets, fruit drinks, soft drinks, dried fruit. Never say never with these guys, but save them for the special occasion. It's very, very easy to get tumbling down that rabbit hole with Alice and end up with eating these things every single day. I speak from experience when William was first born, there were some dark days, dark, dark days, eating chocolate for breakfast and, you know, sneaking, hiding wrappers in my pockets. I always got found out though because Anna washes my clothes. Anyway, so yeah, never say never, but save it for a special occasion. Don't consume these things every single day. And when we're talking about this, we're talking about replacing, not removing, yeah? So if I'm going from eating oats and toast and potatoes, rice and pasta, I'm probably looking at, right, okay, hierarchy-wise, let's try and replace those now. Let's try and replace it with one to two cups of vegetables. So if I'm having a piece of toast for breakfast, for example, I could chop up some vegetables, I could throw it in an omelette, cook it through, then I've obviously I've got my carbohydrates and my vegetables and my protein, which we're going to talk about in another habit, um, in together. And then obviously now I've got an omelette, which is obviously keeping me full and getting those one to two cups of veg in there. Um, as well, yeah. So avoid the refined carbohydrates. Keep those for celebrations only. Type two carbohydrates post workout. Type one the rest of the time. But you've got to be realistic, guys, as to where you are coming from with this habit. So if you're coming from Coca Cola and a Mars bar for breakfast, move up that tier. Let's change that for now. A piece of sourdough. I don't know with with some avocado on top, yeah? If we're coming from the avocado on toast, then now let's start experimenting with the omelette. You've gotta be realistic to where you are at currently, um, and big jumps don't always work. Yeah, these are your smart cards, these are your not so smart carbohydrates. So what I want to say to you guys before you go, it's all well and good watching these lessons, and I'm so, so, I'm humbled by you all, the fact that some of you are watching these lessons. Thank you so much for doing so. But You've got to take action. It's all one good looking at the white one. Oh, that's pretty, pretty interesting information there. Yeah, I like that. Take some action on it. Take some action on it today. Yeah? Don't waste your life not being happy with the way you look and the way you feel. Yeah? Try, if you take action today, get moving. Get to the shops. Prep some food. Get some starchy carbohydrates bought. Get some high fiber carbohydrates, some vegetables. Get those guys in. Throw the rubbish out. Get rid of those highly processed carbohydrates. If they're in your vicinity, you will eventually consume them. Get rid of them. Life is too short not to be happy with your body composition. So please, 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 please don't just listen, which I love for the fact you are listening. Take some action for yourself, yeah? I want you to think, what can I do today to achieve my body composition goals? What can I do this week? And what can I do long term to achieve the body composition and everything that I desire? Yeah, so I'll see you guys tomorrow for another lesson.